Hello guys, you can see the four number addition puzzles. I have watched three number puzzles. And also like uh, last one is a little bit complicated and like uh, that problem, you can get uh, a lot of pains to solve the, that problem. For the first three things, I can solve the, those three things a little bit easy and a little bit faster than the other professional math teacher and professor. Let's try. Yes, for the, this first one, yes, usually they just try to first uh, check the, like the value of A using the sum of the, those three digit number but uh, I can simply say this one any two digit number always less than 100 this one also less than 100 less than 100 so this one must be 300 yes so A can be just uh, 1 or 2 Zero is impossible. Even though we just found that the possibility of A is one or two, but in this problem, you just look uh, like those letters. You can easily see it like this C. And also you can see that this C. A plus B plus C make it just to see what does that mean this one which means a plus b must be 10 right so this 10 k of the 10th digit so you can get like what a plus b plus c plus and this one make it b but a plus b already just 10 which means 1 plus C must be B or 10 but this case is impossible which means if 1 plus C is 10 that time B is 0 this one is impossible so only 100 carry over here which means A must be 1 that time b must be 9 because a plus b is 10 and also c must be 8 because 1 plus c is b you just check up this one okay 11 because a is 1 99 because B is nine B is nine and eighty A. If you add up them all, this one is ten, so this is eight, one carryover, this one is ten, so nine and one. This is A, B, C. Perfect. Little bit simple, right? Let's try next one. Yes, for this second problem, this one like looks like the first one, but they just use only three digit number. So like number one, I mean first one, you can first try to find the B, that's correct. But we just check the, uh, what is the possibility of B, okay? Even though just uh, most students and the teachers use 999, 888, but I don't like it. Those uh, A, 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 B, 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 C, 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 C are just a three digit number, which means less than 1,000, all of them. So this one must be less than 3,000, which means B is also 1 or 2. And then we just check the one digit a plus b plus c make it 
this C. I said this one stands for A plus B must be 10. So this 10 carry over to just the 10th digit. I said A plus B already just the 10th, so 1 carry over. So you can consider 1 plus C is uh, just A. But I said this case C cannot be 9 because when C equals 9, A is 10. I said A is not 0, B also, C is also not 0. So you can say 1 plus C must be A. Understand me? For the hundreds of digit like this one, same things, you know? So using the this idea, you can try to find that. I mean, you can easily find the B first. B is here. Because I said one A plus B is just 10, which means 1000. I wrote the 1 plus C is A. So B must be just 1. That time, A is 9. So C is A. Using the, these two things. Let me check that. 999, those are A things. 111 and 888. If you add up them all, this is already 10, so this is 8. 10 carry over, 10 and 9, so 19, so this 100 carry over, so you will get 1,998. 1, That's it. Let's try next one. Okay, let's try this problem. As we solved the first two problem, I just used this idea. Send it four digit numbers, so this is less than one ten thousand. This one also less than ten thousand. So money, this five digit number must be twenty thousand, which means M is just one. Assumption is M is not zero. You know? Now I'm going to try to find the alphabet O or S. That time you have to conceive E plus for the hundred digit, E plus O greater than 10 or not, okay? Because one can be carried over, you know? This time S plus 2 is 10 plus O. Not carry over one, this one. So just S plus one equals ten plus. There are two cases, this one and this one. This one means S is A plus alphabet O. This case, S is nine plus alphabet O. You have to consider this S is just a single digit number. This case, this alphabet O must be number zero. This case, this alphabet O can be zero or one. Right? I said S can be early and most just a nine, but one is impossible because M already one. So this case also zero. It's just zero. That time, e plus up number zero is not ten, so this one is not carry over. But you have to make uh, s plus one must be this ten, so s must be nine. We found the value of s and o. I want to first copy it. Understand? 
Now you just look the hundred digit e plus zero equals n. This is impossible because e is not equal to n, which means e plus one. This one stands for just one carry over here. Okay, that time this is uh, just n like this one, which means n plus l at least nine because d plus e can be over 10 so you have to consider two cases I mean d plus e equal to just y that time there is a no one carrier for the 10th digit n plus l must be greater than 10 10 plus e because we needed this one other case, I mean d plus e can be greater than 10, 10 plus y, that time 1 carry over here, so n plus r plus 1 must be 10 plus e. I said we need this one because of this one. Now, this case, you have to consider these two cases using the substitution method right here for e I'm going to try to find the r because if you solve for e that time this is m minus 1 first case left hand side is m plus r right this side is 10 plus e is m minus 1 right here right so that time n is cancelled out so r is 9 but this is impossible because s already 9 so this is not true holy this one is just a first case second case i just plug in here m plus r plus 1 equals 10 plus e is m minus 1 so this ends are cancel out 10 minus 1 equals 9 you just move this one to right hand side r is just a yes this is correct so you can say r is a i want to first copy the a for all mm. it goes n and also d plus e is 10 plus y you just consider only two equations using the, this two equation we are going to find the remaining letters okay which one is better I just want to use this one but you have to know that this expression this one means e n ends are just consecutive and is one more than e after finding the value of e automatically you can determine the value of n okay n plus e equals 10 plus y uh just uh, check the one numbers left you know we already use one zero this a nine and this a so two three four five six seven is left okay but the d plus e must be 10 plus y which means that this one can be like uh, seven plus six or seven plus five or six plus five but this case this is 11 which means because of this one y is one this is impossible because m is already 1 okay we just consider this case 7 plus 5 which is 12 but we don't know which one is 7 which one is 5 you know that we have to consider other case if this 7 is e that time m must be 8 but that case is impossible so this 7 for the this d that time e is just a 5 
the time n is 6. Oh, that's true. I mean, in this case, d equals 7, e equals 5, so n equals 6. That's it. How about this case? This one is number 13, right? So which one can be 7? If 7 is this e, I said it's impossible because that time n is 8 because of this one are already a so this case d must be 7 so e is 6 but when e equals 6 n is 7 again so this one also impossible so we found d equals 7 e equals 5 n equals 6 this is 12 which means y is 2 I mean, this one is impossible. We found all of that. We just checked our answer is correct or not. Yes, we found uh, the value of each letter. So we just checked uh, this one is correct or not. Send, which means 9,000. E is 500. And it's 6. D is 7. More means one thousand zero hundred and eighty five. If you add up them, this is two, one carryable, fifteen, so five, one carryable again, just a six, nine plus one is just a ten. So this is M, this is uh, alphabet O. This 6 is N, this 5 E, this 2 is Y. This is money. Okay. If you understand this one, you can have a lot of money. Just kidding. Yes. I just want to introduce this problem. Even though you can say, oh, this is terrible. But uh, you can be terrorist. You can be this one. Even though when you try this one, you have a lot of pain in the neck, like this problem, okay? Hopefully, you just try this problem. Uh, if you couldn't solve this one, you can send me to SOSSI, okay? I can solve this problem for you guys. Hopefully, you just enjoy this video and this problem. See you next time. Thank you.